wow, it wasn't working before. Is it, where is it? Oh, yeah. I think so. Yeah, See look, because now it's counting off. <laughs> yeah. It just said live before, but no count. Yeah. Um, they missed great stuff. They missed me oh, singing Taylor Swift. <laughs> That's great stuff. Um, what else did they miss? They missed me talking about how we had great stuff planned for today's stream. Oh, we have a lot of great stuff. We have a lot of great Lots stuff of planned for you guys today. On the eve of Jesus' birth. Is that real? I mean, you know, it's probably just like, they probably fudged it a bit to make the pagans happy. You know, some like solstice shit. Some and negotiated The pagans day. probably didn't get the solstice that accurate. You know, I was like, oh, December 25th, that's the shortest day. Off by four hour, you know? I don't know. I don't know if there's anybody in this chat room either. Oh, there's someone here. Someone saying, hey, pretty. Did my other stream work or not? Oh, do you want to check if I got all the I don't know. What is wrong uh, If I wanted to know who you were hanging with when I was gone, I would have asked you. It's a kind of cold Jordan, that fogs up windshield line. glass. Ah! But I felt it when I passed. George, still no message that you All right, well, we got some people in here. They're yeah. only my subscribers. Maybe they got are you a subscriber? Oh, I just got it. Right now. Oh, right now. Just okay. Wait, did the other one go through or no? No. Just one. Oh, right I now. see. All right, cool. Is it aching you? Know. Put their body aching me. If it's all the same to you, then it's the same to me. Oh, yeah. No, I told them we were talking about what would it mean to write a Christmas song today. And the best thing I could come up with is... What ends when the symbols shatter? Yeah. We are isolated in many ways This in this 2020. Isolated from what? Each other. The distance between people has never been further. We have Pizzagate believers and we have climate change believers. You and know? deniers. And deniers. You know, whenever there's deniers of something, you just, you just wonder. What do you wonder? I mean, like, is this the place we're getting bagels? No, no one's no, no one's ever been to Wilkes. Uh, yeah, hey, you know, I, I, no, we're going to Goldbergs. Well, you're going to Goldbergs. Nuffy says hi. Hey, George and Alex. Hi. Merry Christmas, Georgie. Alex is pretty. Poop. <laughs> we got good quality comments this high morning. High quality. Yeah. What does it feel like to be rich and powerful? Oh wow. How clear is it that you're both of That's very unclear, I think you know. Is relative. Like we're grateful, you know. Are we think, grateful, Alex? Gratitude, is, this, is this some damn Thanksgiving yeah, shit? Yeah, I think gratitude. Wow, a good part you're on of your rich. you're on your Thanksgiving. Uh, this gratitude is Goldberg's. Is uh, help yourself to whatever you want. I'm good. I ate I ate waffles this morning. Yeah. Mm, we now have. Plant-based bacon and plant-based sausage. The fuck? Oh, uh, what's the temperature here in Cali, bros? We ain't in Cali. Who can figure out where we are? I don't know. Who can figure it out? What town we're in? They don't know. Do they? San Diego's in Cali. Love the commitment to streaming. Thank you. Why aren't I wearing face diapers? Because bros, you know, I say this stuff, I say this stuff and it just shocks me. It shocks me with the political hate, man. You know, what do you think you're gonna do? You're gonna be like, George, I, I, you should stick to programming. You sound so dumb when you talk about masks. Do I? Or is that a rhetorical tactic? You, know, you may not even be aware that you're doing it. The people who do it may not even be aware. It might just be so second nature to you. Um, you know, I'm going to quote the Taylor Swift documentary. Uh, you know, Taylor Swift came out and talked about politics, right? And what you found is that a lot of the Republican commentators insulted her intelligence. Not her ideas, but her intelligence. You guys are doing the same thing, right? Um, so, no, uh, bad news for people who thought masks did something. Uh, they don't, but uh, you know, they're probably not bad. Uh, but the good news is, the good news is, following up on coronavirus things, I was, I was, I was surprised that uh, mRNA vaccines seem to work. Um, my non-medical advice is don't get the Moderna or the AstraZeneca, get the Pfizer. I don't own Pfizer stock, I tell you if I did. Anti-maskers, anti-maskers, oh no! So you guys make it, you know, you guys is political loser shit. Not political, read the studies. 
And don't tell me the studies about how far the particles go. Show me studies that actually study virus transmission in the presence or absence of masks. Um, but we're not here to talk about that. Uh, we're also the people who tell me how I should use my voice. Uh, here's my thoughts on being canceled. And I'm going to quote Lil Wayne to you guys, right? Uh, hype train incoming. All right. We know people know the truth, man. Uh, this is a Lil Wayne quote. Uh, when you're great, it's not murder. It's assassinate. So assassinate me, bitch. Because I'm doing the same shit Martin Luther King did. Stepping in the same hotel in the same suite, bitch. Same balcony. Like assassinate me, bitch. And that's how I feel about that, you know? People are so soft today. Watch The Sopranos, you know? I feel hard, man. <laughs> Jersey, home of Tony Soprano. This man is a menace, someone needs to stop him! <laughs> uh, Lil Wayne is going to jail. Can we pardon Wheezy? We don't need to pardon Paul Manafort. No, 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 we need to pardon Wheezy. And I'm coming out, you know what? You know who needs a pardon? Ross Albrecht, because if he really did murder for hire, the government would have tried him for that. They knew it was some fake ass case. All he did was make it safer for people to buy drugs. Ross Albrecht is a national hero and he should be pardoned. That's right. But Taylor and Lil Wayne are very similar people. They're both breaking boundaries. Pardon Wheezy. That's right, pardon Wheezy, you know? Uh, we gotta wait, we gotta wait for Alex uh, at the bagel store. And Screlly, how could I forget? Pardon Screlly. Uh, Ross Albrecht and Lil Wayne. Top three pardons right there. Um, thoughts on jail? Oh, well, I don't know. I've never been. I'd like to do an internship. Low Security Federal. If someone could make that happen, I'd like to do three months in Low Security Federal. Just so I could say I went to jail, man. It'll improve my rap career. Uh... Yo, Ross made me rich off Bitcoin, yeah. Um, look, man, if he actually set up people to have murder, people murdered, that's not cool. But, you know, that's not what they tried him for. So, you know. Uh, dry, oh, Jai is the, is the Jonathan Blow album, uh, language. I've seen it a little. Uh, I don't know, I haven't really looked at it yet. I mean, all I want is Python, but faster. Maybe a few cleanups to the Python syntax. Uh, Highlands, North Carolina. No, no, it's not. Oh, wow, Alex is really taking a long time. She must have got something fancy, you know? Um, no, bug bounty is a way to take all of this hacker revolutionary energy and feed it into a shit tier corporate system, you know? And I'm not saying, like, don't do it. If you're going to do it, though, do pwn to own, and then you get your message out there. Don't do bug bounties, you know, privately. They slip you the money under the table. That's what the corporations love, man. The corporations just want it all to be kept under wraps, all kept quiet. We don't want to keep it quiet. We are revolutionaries, boys. We're revolutionaries, you know? But don't be an obnoxious revolutionary who goes around and talks about how he's a revolutionary a lot of times like a mortal technique but now mortal technique's cool so i don't know why i'm dissing a mortal technique when there's so many better rappers to diss like drake who used to be good said things like um when it falls apart you know i'm still down to pick a million tiny little pieces off the ground where she would learn to love people and use things and not the other way around that was old drake let me tell you about new drake it goes left foot slide right foot slide I don't care which foot, either way, we about to slide. And then a bunch of grunts and moans. Now we like a mortal technique. Mortal technique is actually pretty cool. Um, Drake's good song from old Drake. Yeah, 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 pound cake music in here. Um, they should put a couple more mirrors in here so I could stare at myself. These are usually just some thoughts that I would share with myself, but fuck it. I figure it's worth it to share it with someone else other than Paris for once. I text her from time to time. She a mom now. Sometimes that shit forces you to calm down. I told her she could live with me if she need to. Got a compound, but I think she's straight. Uh, oh, there's a new Eminem album? The last ones, you know. Tucson Leather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lil Dicky. I <laughs> like Lil Dicky back in the day. Professional rapper, you know. What a good sentiment. Um, I do... Uh, 
own a company, owns a strong. I work at a company. Um, you know, we got some, we got some crazy shit planned for 2021. 20, uh, guys aren't gonna believe it. You know, all right, well, let's talk about some comma shit. So at Common, we have a, I can't call it a supercomputer. I call it a, I call it a supercomputer. I just can't call it a data center. That's right. We have a supercomputer that's equivalent to one dog. We have one dog's worth of compute power. One dog's worth of compute power draws 50 kilowatts and costs half a million dollars. How crazy is that? Next supercomputer, we're gonna have one human worth of compute power. And this is why home robotics never happened. I'm predicting a huge decade for home robotics this decade. But right now, you know the Comma 2? It has equivalent compute power to a bee, right? Could a bee be a maid? I don't know. Could a mouse be a maid? I think Disney made a movie about that. Yes, so we need a mouse worth of power, but a mouse is about a thousand bees. So we're gonna need, you know, we're gonna need a thousand Snapdragon 820s or maybe, um, maybe four 3090s. Oh, sorry, A100s, what? We're gonna sit on the bench. You don't wanna walk? Oh, you wanna sit on this bench? No, but there's too many people around this bench. There's given whole audience. No, I don't want an audience. Can we go, can we go that way more? There's, a, there's better bench by the library. It's gotta be closed. What do you think? It's two blocks. Okay. Can we wait two blocks? Yes. Block up, block up, block up. Should you trust a bee to drive your car itself? I mean, you can trust it for little things, but I'd always be watching it. What's happening here? What? Wait, is this the line for Mark's Cheesecake? No way. That's wild, man. Mark's killing it today. Did you do like a free cheesecake or something? Nope. <laughs> wow, Mark, you know. Oh, we got the hype train back. Level two, hello, everybody. Mm. 5.99 viewers. Tis the damn season. What? You wanna go sit by? We can sit by City Hall. City Hall's nice. The city Hall's pretty nice. Maybe he's a nice guy. Uh, the corruption must be somewhere else. This town's very corrupt. It is? Yeah, why else would property taxes be so high? What do they do? I wish you could get like an audit and see where your money went. How cold is it out here? It's not like North Pole, Alaska, which we watched recently on the DIY Network. Great channel. By the way, guys, Discovery Plus starts January 4th. It's only $4.99 a month. You can watch all your Stop. favorite shows, including extra 90 day fiance content. Uh, I just, I do it for free, boys. Discovery's not paying me. Though, I did see BattleBots is back. We were watching BattleBots last night and some people were in masks, so it was this probably pretty newly recorded. Yeah, this train goes to New York, I mean, so does that one. The bus? The bus? Yeah, the bus goes to New York too. I mean, that's kind of the only places to go. Level two complete. Oh, all your hamsters, thank you for subscribing. Everybody who subscribed, thank you for subscribing. We appreciate you. If you didn't subscribe, we appreciate you less. Um, and why is in quarantine? Bro, all the quarantines are optional. This is America, you have freedom here. Is it nice in here? Oh, yeah. Not really. Like we're I mean, this is where I'm no, it's really cute. All right, well, like. you can go to the library with a bench to sit on. Where's the yeah, the mask is optional. Well, no luck. I, you, someone can kick you out of their private business. You can sit over there. Uh, if you're not wearing a mask, that's their property. Don't violate someone's rules on their property. But this is outside, man. No one owns the outside. I'm a free citizen of America. Uh, did I like Evermore? I loved Evermore. Much better than folklore. Taylor Swift really refined it on Evermore. Um, Coney Island and Tis the Damn Season. Also, uh, I think he did it, but he just can't prove it. You know, that's that's a good, that's Dude, a good. What happened to this building? What do you mean? Look how nice it is, like a neoclassical building, and then look at this. Tree. Oh, and they put little shits on it? Yeah, well, it had to get bigger. Glen Rock is a growing town, that's a lie. Oh, sketchy gloves. Um, all right. Uh,
You know, it's just, you can't believe it. Bro, you know who's worse than mask people? Political losers. That's right. Uh, we just promote science and the truth on this channel. What have you been telling them about? Your Freedom. Match? No. What else are we going to talk about today? Um, we had great content planned, I forget. I quoted the Lil Wayne quote about being canceled. Mm -hmm. So assassinate me, bitch. Um, doing the same you shit about the comments? King did. No, we already talked about the comments. Okay, you were the haters have already them. been addressed. Haters know their place. Oh yeah, no, they were mad that I was saying that being rich is a state of mind. But it totally is. I think it's, you know. How would anyone doubt that? Some people have a ton of money and think they're poor, and some people don't have much money and think they're rich, you know? That's right. Tis the day of season, you know? Don't show you eating. Don't show you eating? Don't show, I'm going to be self-conscious. All right, all right. I'm so self-conscious. That's why I see me with at least one of my watches. Mm. Um, if Naval said that, it'd get a million retweets. I'm not a thought leader. Oh, they missed my thing in CVS. You know, what's the difference between me and a schizophrenic homeless man? I have 592 people watching me. Mm -hmm. Is it a good joke? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Show food. Can, can you show the food? I want to see the food. I have a sandwich. All right, sandwich and chips. What kind of chips are that? Would I, I like them? Onion. No, you wouldn't do that to me. I wouldn't. You wouldn't do me like that. I'm an anti-thought leader. You come out of here with freedom. Freedom doesn't mean you have to agree with me. All freedom means is that you're doing what you want and not what someone else wants for you. Is it Christmas? Tomorrow. It's a train. Yeah, look over there. I'm turning into Terry Davis day by day. What? Turning into Terry Davis day by day. I don't know, boys. I'm predicting two things for the next decade. One, personal robotics. And two, augmented reality. The 2020s are going to be a great decade. The 2010s, shit decade. Did you tell them about? Well, they really were. Like some, yo, you guys, if you want to watch a great show, it's called Cleopatra 2525. It's about the year 2525 when robots took over the surface of the earth and they're forced underground. And these three women are on a mission to fight back. Mm -hmm. And one of them is Victoria Pratt, who still looks very good, even though she's 50. And she one just came out way. with an adult novel. Which actually got a 4.5 stars on Amazon and very good reviews. We're so, going to live read it. I'm excited to read that book. See, Story look, time I talk like an ad, but I don't even get paid for any of this shit. Do you want to be paid for this? No, because then they'd influence my decisions and that would affect my freedom. I know if I leave everyone. And you know what we value on this? We value two things on this stream. We value freedom and truth. Now, those two things are at odds sometimes. And if they're at odds, truth over freedom every time. Truth over freedom every time. Yeah. I'll quote old Drake. Truth over fame. You know, I respect blatant shit. I'll quote new Drake. Uh, 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 sometime we laugh, sometime we cry, sometime we do both at the same time. Wait, really? No, that would be too good. But it is sometime we laugh, sometime we cry, and then the rest of the line is too stupid that I don't even remember it. Oh, are you eating on the stream? What kind of sandwich you got? What's that? Piece of bread. What kind of sandwich you got? Just a veggie sandwich. Does that have any sauce on it? Uh-huh. No, it doesn't. You're mm -hmm. lying to me, so I don't eat any of it. What kind of sauce? <laughs> vinegar. Oh, I love vinegar. I'm going to have a bite. Just a bite. Mm. Mm. Yum. Good thing I got my jaw dysfunction fixed to physical therapy. George, you can't eat on your stream. You have to have decorum. 
And all I say Who to you, that? all I say to you is what ends when the symbols shatter. <laughs> mm. um, can, I have, can I have another bite? Just one more bite. I didn't even get a good sized bite. There was too much wrapper in the way. Um, oh no, I want like that. I want like a good like bite of all the veggies and stuff. Can you give me a little bit? My lunch. What? I just want a bite. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a dick. <laughs> mm. Had a backup consciousness. Do you know what do you know what dating is like, George? Do I know what dating is like? No dating you. No. I've never dated myself. Yeah. A, you, want well, to, you, want, you want to tell them about it? Don't worry, they're all men. I'm not worried about the bad things you're gonna say about me. You just have to be prepared to give George half. If you have something, be happy, all I ask for is half. That's all I'm saying. If you have something, you should be expected that George is going to take half of it. Hey, that's a reasonable taxation rate, you know? <laughs> Many countries are okay on 50% taxation rates. If you live in California and you make a good amount of money, they take half. Right? Dating George is just, the man always wants half. <laughs> 50% okay. too much. What a nightmare. <laughs> You are cute. She is cute, isn't she? I don't know why she puts up on me. Oh, am I moving to Texas? No, no. I'm never moving to Austin or Miami. Every time a thought leader says I want to move to a place, I want to move there this much less. And this much has add up a lot. About Miami. Um, we live in San Diego. It's a nice place. I want to move the company to a mansion. Whoa, you can't say it's about taxes. If you say it's about taxes, California's going to take your money. Move to Canada. I hear there's only rednecks in Canada. The only things I know that came from Canada are Trailer Park Boys and Victoria Pratt. Too cold for me. Mm, I like the sandwich better than the chips. Me too. Should we get another one? No! We're going to walk to another place when we get something there. Deal. All right. We got to get moving. We got to start walking. Yeah, we got hours to go here. Miles to go before I sleep. Miles George to go before I sleep. George said he would never marry in an interview. Can we get married, Alex? Respect George's wishes, always. Can we get married, Alex? Are we getting married? Are we? Maybe. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Tune in to next episode. Tune in to the next episode to find out. Ready for fake drama? First, we have to get to an island. Mm. We First, we got to change the marriage First, laws. We get to an island with other singles. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. You see, gay marriage went the wrong way. You know how they gave gays the right to marry? They should have taken the right to marry away from the straights. That would have been good. The guy at the airport told me he saw me on Love Island. You were on Love Island? That's pretty cool. Mm. Shows my hat. Oh, Tech Optimist. Oh, so nice. I can't see it. I can't read. Can you show it to them. To the... They have big screens. They have big screens. They know I don't zoom in my console. We got special console. hats made. Should we move to Mars? Start family? Yeah. We're moving to Mars. Screw. Mm. No, George has strict policy on going to Mars. That's right. Until there's five, five star, star hotels. hotels. He's not going. Oh, I got you something. We got water, smart water for us. This I did know you were going to have 50%. You're so thoughtful. Yeah. That's something I'd have two thirds of. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's up. It goes by body weight. Wait, what's dirty and wait, what's Twitch censorship? I'm not censoring anything. A lot of those people who complain about censorship, if they just wanted to, you know? Look at Alex Jones. He owns band.video. He loves that shit. He, wait. He does it to get banned. Of course. It's great free advertising. Great free advertising. You guys, you do understand Gillette decided, it, Gillette tried to intentionally trigger you. Should we make a triggering piece of content for comma? No, like, like, remember the Gillette, like, like, Jake ad campaign? Like, Gillette was like, we're losing to Dollar Shave Cub Club. We own a failing razor company. What can we do to be relevant? Trigger a lot of people. It's just PETA. It's the same tactics PETA used. Peter's really toned it down. I know. We Peter looks, Peter looks reasonable now these days, you know? Are you talking about the decline of science? We've been talking about oh, that we have been talking about the decline of science. That's right. Has there been any new science since 1970? Not talking about new technology. You know, this okay, mRNA you vaccine. Explain what the difference between technology and science is. Science is the new idea. Technology is the new implementation. Has there been any Higgs boson. 
you know, like, That's wow, technology. wow. Okay. No, the Higgs boson, I mean, the Higgs boson was discovered through technology, but it wasn't new science. We knew exactly where it was. It's the same shitty standard model, which takes 43 arbitrary parameters into it. N neural nets. No, string theory is completely bogus. It's not science. String theory's never made a testable prediction, as far as I know. Neural nets are the closest we've come, I think. I, th I think neural nets are like, we now have an understanding of what learning is. Um, it's like, when did humanity learn how to fly? When did we learn what flight was? I mean, I'm sure some guys took a bird apart a wait, thousand wait. years ago. Took a bird apart? They, they're just apart birds everywhere. Yeah, you see, da, da Vinci is well known for uh, yeah, Da Vinci. The exactly. Yeah, We've like Da Vinci. Birds for a long yeah, time. but it wasn't until the early 20th century when we actually made shit fly that we understood flight. So today we're going to make things think and then we're going to understand thought. Axions. What are axions? Do you mean axons or axioms? Are we worse <laughs> at doing science? No, I think the universities have seriously declined after 19, uh, 1970. Okay. I mean, I think the whole, the whole, like we were just talking about really okay, how... I have a, a controversial yeah. question. Do we think that ethics has, <laughs> has inhibited our ability to study nature? I've said this, I mean, I said this in my New Yorker interview back in the day. I, I think that like ethics aren't real. There's no such thing. They're, they're, ethics are just a, a, a something to browbeat other people with. Well... They may not be real. Like, morals are real. You can have morals, you can have a moral code. But this idea that there is a universal ethics, that's just, that's just like, you know, it's, 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 it's even stupider than religion, right? Like, religion at least has a nice, like, unifying effect to it, and we can all eat the cracker, you know? Um, the wafer. Wafer. Drink the wine, eat the wafer. Look, man, I'm a Christian, you know? I believe Jesus died for my sins. Well, Alex doesn't, you know, you, do you know about Jesus? Let's talk about the J question. J question? The Jesus question? The answer is yes. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, are ethics and morals the same thing? No, morals are individualist and ethics are where they lecture you in a college class freshman year with 300 other people so you can learn how to be a good person. I want to talk about the monkey study. You know, we, there's what a lot of science study? we wouldn't be able to do today because we should test it on animals. Well, that's Peter's problem. Peter's like the news, but worse. I'm curious. I'm curious. You know, I don't have a strong, I don't have an opinion, but I'm, I wonder if science has been inhibited by that. Mm. That's all. I think it's possible. Yeah, I think that, that, that you know, look, I mean, and, you know, like Google's going to fire their AI ethics team. Do it, Google. Do you think um, morals or ethics are necessary? Wait, Elon's testing what on pigs? Oh, yeah, he is. Oh, he's testing the, uh, he's testing the Neuralink on pigs. How did he get away with that? He proved it doesn't because cause him any harm. Because Elon tweets on Twitter. He's like pronouns wow you're stupid and people are like Elon you Why can't say that and then he voice. does <laughs> you said you're talking you're an atheist imagine Trump but smart yeah, we did, let, I'm saying World War II is probably the last time yeah um, we're gonna test the comma we animals. hit the limits of intellectual <laughs> capacity of humans I mean that's true oh that, that was another one of my recent like analogy thoughts what? take a supercomputer from 1980 Okay. And now put it next to a supercomputer from 2020. Okay. You can, everyone can tell which one's better. Sure. You take the smallest child and they could tell, sure. damn, that one's good. Yeah. Right? Now do the same with people. You strip them down, you know, and put a 1980 person and a 2020 person. The 2020 person is fatter and stupider. Only a little, but yeah. Like a t marginal, on average, well, on like average. a tiny, tiny amount. Yeah, stupid, yeah. dumber. Yeah, a tiny amount dumber, but you know, those tiny amounts add up. They're a little bit dumber and a little bit fatter. The tiny amounts do add up. Yeah. Um, so, like, who are you betting on long term? What? The Flynn saying. effect stopped a long time ago, guys. Dude, reverse. The Flynn effect was mostly due to malnutrition. 2020 person does have a phone, that's true, but again, I put phones firmly in the uh, computer camp. I was thinking about the question I had about, can you teach someone how to Google? You think Henry VIII was clever? Yeah, probably. Died, divorced, died, died, divorced, survived. Six wives, man. Yeah, boss. Boss. So now people, people go to the People still die more? of starvation? Not in America, they don't. When's the last time someone died of starvation in America? I'm just glad he didn't mention Africa. I 
feel like people always do that when they mention starvation. I mean, like, again, Africa's a large continent. I'm sure there's many countries oh, man. where Alice? nobody is starving. We do want to play golf. No one's starving in Egypt and South Africa. Probably no one's even starving in Kenya and Ethiopia. I would love to actually know the exact numbers. Oh, if you go to like South starving. Sudan or the Democratic People's Republic of the Congo, then maybe, maybe things don't look as good, but you know. A lot of questions. Questions. What are you listening to? You're listening to just chatting. Leibniz at some time Wait. was said was the last man to know everything. He never met Terence Tao. What I hear that guy knows stream? everything. Uh, Tis the damn season. If phones are comparable to technological implants. Oh yeah, yeah. Well, the dude's gonna have brain implants. But again, you have got to put that in the machine camp. Probably starving. Right. If I could bet on man versus machine. You said there is new science. I was tech any different. Uh, well, so my distinction between science and technology is technology is the implementation, science is the idea, right? You can come up with, you can't come up with the idea for an mRNA vaccine in 1900. In 1970, you could. You know, they had the central dogma of electrobiology, biology, they had all that stuff, right? Now, did you have like the DNA technology to do it? No, probably not, right? The idea for TAC polymerase came way before actual TAC polymerase. This is like how they had ideas for early computers in the 1800s. What are my morals? I learned morality from Captain Janeway of the Starship Voyager. So same as hers. <laughs> <laughs> um, talk about opening the cathedral. What cathedral are you referring to? I think we have a nice mm. Oh yeah, Alex, we're gonna try Urbit. Oh, man, should we chill for Urbit on the we're stream? We're gonna do an Urbit stream. Later. We're gonna do, should we do an Urbit stream? Yeah, I would love that. Oh, Wait, we should do our urban stream will be legendary. Wait, Let's do the urban you, stream. You, you, you know, you can talk about. You want to talk about your relationship with Urban? What about it? I love Urban. So no, just your relationship. I, yeah. I worked on Urban. Yeah, Alex. Alex worked at Urban for a year. It's true. Yeah. We, we, we're gonna do an urban stream. We're doing an urban stream. How do you guys feel? I've heard Urban. The average IQ is one thirty. This remains to be no, no, seen. To use? No, no, to use. <laughs> what, what, what did you just say? What do you think the average IQ on Urban is? Oh, at least. Yeah, that's what I'm least. saying, right? Um, so yeah, we'll find the less smart people on the internet. They're just in an enclave. If it's accessible from a mobile phone, it's full of idiots. It's true. I mean, it's true. It's just statistical. Yeah. What's the average mobile phone user internet IQ versus desktop? I think much higher. Yeah, and then I'm sure with operating system, you know, oh, Windows, I'm Mac, really Linux. Urban. I'm upset that we're walking. I want to go to my you want to urban it right now? Oh. Um, if I want to know. What did I have to say about her? Anything good? Lana would have asked you. Uh, no, what do we got? Did Alex like working at Pop Sugar? Oh, yeah. yeah. That's a great team. Uh, where is this place? They do have train in America? They do on the Eastern Seaboard. It's true. Is, Ar is Curtis Yarvin a uh, fashy crackpot or a genius? I'm putting him in the genius camp. Wait, Curtis is a genius. Alex Jones I'm goes to the crackpot camp. Charming. Charming. He's charming. There's a lot of charm. Terry Davis was a charming crackpot. Yeah, he was. No, rest in peace. You know, not, not trying to rip on him, man. Terry Davis did more for humanity than 99% of people. Curtis, he talks a lot. Curtis talks people a lot. People talk yeah. to get in trouble. It's just how well, it is. No, it's also, yeah, like, the man has no filter. And, like, <laughs> you know. I've been, it's charming. It's charming. I um, rip Joe Rogan? What happened to Joe Rogan? What happened? What, okay? what, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cancel Joe Rogan, you know? You know, I think there's like a Star Trek episode where they fire the weapon at a ship from the future, and the ship from the future uses the deflector dish and blows the other ship up. Yeah, I think that's what happens if you try to cancel Joe Rogan, you know? Oh, yeah, ho, ho, ho. Yeah, yeah, take, take, take. We have to no, you the don't camera. Have to crash the it's gonna. Crash. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, oh. Can you guys see? Wait. Hold on. Where's George? <laughs> Where are you? I hope you got on there. What up? Yeah, no, it's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. Ring Elon Musk and got him. No, I can't be on Rogan, boys. Too much heat. Wait, how many viewers we got? Oh, 662. How do I get the chat back? What happened to Show the chat? Show chat. 
Yo, yo, yo. George should take over the Temple OS project. I tried coding in Holy City. It was it's too much for me, man. It's too much for me. You gotta be on a level to code Holy City. Well, I did better than having a code last night, so I'm in a better mood. I'm do great, but it was competitive this year. Tonight's last night. Yeah, I'm in a lower place, yet I have more points. Do you know original Santa Claus was a skinny guy? <laughs> that was a good family guy gag last night. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh Santa. Hey, you're, you're, you're trimmer than me. I really got I really gotta look at myself. <laughs> uh, Fresh Prince of Bel Air is underrated. What? I don't know. Alright boys. That might be today's stream. Got any plans for Mars? Five star hotel. Um, 2021 goals. Kama's got a lot of goals. But we're busy. Kama's got a lot of goals. You know what we're gonna hit close to the beginning of 2021? We are going to have made more money at Kama than uh, we raised. It's a big and milestone that means it's time to raise some more money. Start doing some big things. I think it might be time. I think it might be raising money time next year, boys. Uh -huh. So if you want to invest in Kama, have $2 million ready. Uh, and get on board with the future. Big checks. Yo, you guys, Kama's not... We're going to solve self-driving cars. You think we're going to stop? Mm -hmm. You're going to stop. You think we're going to solve self-driving cars and stop? No way. Kama's a personal robotics company. You've seen RTC? Just bought controlling ownership of Boston Dynamics. Hyundai. Oh, Hyundai. Hyundai is, is robots, Hyundai is with the future, you know. People. I mean, Hyundai is going to find out. My friend works at Boston Dynamics, and they'll, you know, look, I love Boston Dynamics, um, but they're going to find out when they ask the CEO. They're like, okay, so what are you going to do to make money? The CEO's like, what? Hey. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Ah, why don't I have a bodyguard? Who do, who do you think I am? Look at Alex right here, she's strapped. Always so strapped so when I hit the club. Um, <laughs> what's a lot of movement? You holding the phone, bouncing the up and down. Yeah. Are they gonna get sick? Are they gonna get sick? I don't know. Motion sickness from this roller coaster ride we call Twitch. Yeah, gonna... You know what I need? A small drone. Do they make small drones for your phone? How tall am I? Six foot. <laughs> How much am I strong? Very little. Very little, yeah. Because we value truth and then we value. Maybe we value human. No, actually, there is something we value about truth. You know what it is. No, 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 no. We've established we value. I know, I know. Which value Wait, truth more than freedom? Value more than truth? I think one thing. Love? Narrative. Oh, I was gonna say love. No, you're gonna say love? Oh, that's yeah. so that's so nice. Yeah. I value love after freedom. Oh, yeah, you can tell. I can tell. <laughs> narrative. Is more narrative. Truth? I mean, love can be part of narrative. Yeah, I no, love totally. Is something what do you mean? No, no, no. I will totally take society ending with a really cool narrative than the truth. Oh my god. What? That's. I'm a narrative guy. Narrative is my terminal value. You know? And it, I mean, yeah, and like narrative as a terminal value is like you can get wireheaded, but at least the wireheading machine is complex. You know? Yeah. Like, and I'm, I think I'm okay with that. I mean, we're all going to end up wireheaded. I don't want to end up happiness wireheaded because happiness is simple. Narrative is complex. If there's a computer with more brain power than me writing stories that entertain me, I'll take it. Guys, I'm gonna merge with a machine and live forever. Calling it right now. You know? You've been saying it the whole time. I know. You're consistent. It's been my destiny to solve AI since I was 15, don't you think? I mean, I know. I'm gonna start saying things like that and we're gonna see if people are okay with it. Who wouldn't be? No. Yeah. Who's got beef with that? No, it just sounds a little like crack Who potty. To tell you what your destiny is? That's right. We write our own. The future hasn't been written yet. I'm pretty sure even Hallmark. F. Transhumanism gang. <laughs> Just jailbreak reality. When will AI take over Wall Street, bro? Too late. 
too late. You think it's coked up macho dudes now? I know the guys that work on Wall Street. I don't think they've done cocaine in their life. <laughs> what else we got? Um, free will is played out. Free will was never real. It was never real. Oh. It was what? It was. Sorry, it was, Bruce. What's that? What's that? It was real the whole time. What's your? Real the whole time. It was real the whole time. <laughs> That's my tagline. Oh my God! We're gonna find that out about free will. What a narrative twist. <laughs> That's worthy of M. Night Shyamalan. Who do we want to write the future? What's up with your sidewalk in the neighborhood? There's a lot of things. What? Yeah, probably. There was when will computer science be a useless degree? The better question is when will the average human born have negative utility? We talked about that. Right? What, is, what do they think? No, I don't know. Like, have we already passed that point? With the average human, we put more resources oh, into way. them than they generate. Hello. Um, you know, like, how easy is it? Shit, man. If I worked on a farm, I'd be super psyched to have kids. You know why? Because I'm sick of pulling the hoe. I'm going to have five kids. I'm going to pull five hoes. We're going to grow the farm. You know those acres over there that we haven't uh, ever, ever uh, grown crops on? We're going to do it now once we have the new kids. Right? Today, the only reason people have kids is vanity projects. They're money-losing vanity projects. I don't know. Kids are money losing vanity clear, projects. Based on playing the game of life. Uh, and the value of children. Wow, children. Money losing vanity. You know what else? That's the quote. I liked someone, Ella tweeted. Uh, we like Ella. We do, big fans. Uh, oh, yeah, no, I shilled for her on one of my streams. Oh, good. Um, we like her. Controversial. She said Is she controversial? Interest. What'd she say? Some of the race stuff, I'm like... Oh, uh, I don't like... You know what? You know, who talks about race? Racists, man. You know, like the New York Times. A bunch of damn racists. Like, oh, I mean, we should talk about Oh, it. she's... Oh, we no, that's too bad. Yeah. Um, that's too bad, you know. Just because we're not PC doesn't mean we're fucking racists, man. Don't Good be point. a racist. Good racists point. are losers. No, they really are. We'll talk. Um, <laughs> Yeah, you know, great racists like Jesse Jackson and Al Sharpton, you know? Sexist like the buses in Mexico. Yeah. Huh. George is upset about the women only section on the buses in Mexico. The buses are sexist, Which that's all I'm saying, you know? We had Rosa Parks and we overcame this in this country. Very reasonable. Well, yeah, because they have crime, which I'm not okay with. I look forward to the day when Mexico I'm mayor. When I'm mayor, there's going to be no but, more crime. We're going to make it illegal. Place, they should have said, when crime against women is yeah, here. Yeah, and, when, we'll and, when, and when we have equality, affirmative. Okay. Um, <laughs> Uh, okay, I mean, that's fine. I mean, when are we leaving code purple? When do we not have to wear masks anymore? You just have to have, you know, strong boundaries. If I want to know who Brazil's you were hanging with, when I was gone, I would have asked. Yeah, well, that's because they have crime. They should end crime. It's legal. Crime is legal. Um, no, I was unimpressed with Mexico, mostly because it was 6.55, and I ordered a beer, and they're like, no, we stopped serving at 7. And I'm like... Yo, it's it's a trust day, Siete. A trust. Does that mean before? Your your Spanish is across. Have an adelante. Me español, what? A trust, I think, is before. Vamos. That means we go. Me gusta vamos. Ah. Food is always about the people. Boucher, parar. I don't like to stop. How many languages do I speak? Uh, one. Unless you count programming languages. Wait, yeah, I do think you should count those. Well, then I said no Python and C++. Not, and Python and C, but not really anything else. No, it's just Python and C. Those are the only languages I really know. You know, like a lot of people talk about all these languages they know, and then it's like, okay, now you can't use the documentation. But I still have to use the documentation. Who remembers what an iterator on... You know, whatever, whatever is. Am I shorting Nicola? We should short. Yo, all those SPACs, man. Are we gonna have more SPACs in 2021? SPACs are the new ICO, except it's even stupider. Like at least ICOs, there was an excuse. They were kind of unprecedented. Everybody should know better about SPACs. The SEC should know better about this. Like, how is that legal? The SEC must be making bank off SPACs. That's the only thing that makes sense, right? 
I mean, we can. Yeah, it looks more dry over there. All right, boys. The future of binary exploitation. No, guys. You know. All right, we'll end with this. This is a good one. Uh-oh. Hacking? Stop. Why? Because, you know, so you're moving so much. No, well, i got to move. I don't want to. Okay. Almost. Uh, look. Hacking is about pushing boundaries. Binary exploitation is not hacking anymore. It's just a weird, useless skill. You know, hacking used to mean making furniture with an axe. Right? The definition of hacking changes. Get with the times. You can't do the same shit and be a hacker. It doesn't work like that. That's why you can never institutionalize hackers. Facebook's on a hacker way. Like, can you guys believe that shit? And like, in 2005, it didn't look actually that stupid. Because in 2005, being a hacker was setting up a Linux box and running your LAMP stack, you know? That's what being a hacker was in 2005. That's what's what being... What's being Urbit. Well, I mean, uh, Urbit's trying. We're going to prove that on our next stream. We're going to prove that on our next stream. Scheduled content. Um, what, we could stream from wow. my house without the internet? Wow. Maybe when we get the sick new routers. New router. New we'll router. The new router. Look, I mean, yeah, that's, that's hacking with the parentheses of a different time, right? I mean, what is there to hack on today? Oh, Why you Urbit? Say Urbit over no, over Urbit is Urbit is something. Urbit is a is a great experiment in artificial difficulty. Yeah. Yeah. What is life? What is modern life? Modern life is a great the conquest of Mars, robotics, and augmented reality. Uh, we don't think Mars by the end of the artificial decade. Difficult. No, definitely. Yeah, not Carmack, decade. Carmack really killed. You know. <laughs> we were all talking about Mars by the end of the decade, and then Carmack was like, "All right, so who wants to bet ten grand?" Everyone was silent pretty fast. <laughs> oh, what a guy! Um, do I get mad at Alex about programming? I'm in a really bad mood when I do badly at Advent of Code. I'm upset. George, I don't think you really get mad at me. No, never. As long as I get fifty percent. Fifty percent. Just like the government. Happy. 50% and George is happy. Always. Uh, let's call it the Great Reset. Oh my god. I read that on some conspiracy sites. You guys, there's Whoa. no great conspiracy. It's the same people. It's the same people. Oh my god, it's the same people who like think like Trump was some evil mastermind. He's not. Well, they now think, remember now it's the other people who's like Biden and the deep state are evil masterminds. No one is an evil mastermind. No one's an evil mastermind. Except well, yeah, I don't know about that guy. The last great <laughs> yeah. The last great American dynasty. Oh, he's Russian. Oh, Alex? What? Is that the R word? Yeah. Oh, it's me. I felt the rain. Wait a second. Why? Maybe the Clintons parentheses 1998, but Hillary Clinton couldn't even beat George. Donald Trump in a free and fair election. What? That might be rain. Oh. You can't hear me at all. Oh, okay. Is your hand covering the No, no, no. All right, guys. Guys, we gotta go. We gotta go. We got some things to figure we out. We have Alex. a weather situation. We can make it through. We got a weather situation. All right, wait, wait. Do you have? Can we like wait for the wind to come up and I can have that wind blown hair? We're live on scene here in Glenrock, New Jersey. The weather's so bad I can't even hold the camera still. No, don't do that. That's to that. right, John. How is how are things over there back in Detroit? Back at the news station. Oh, they're not like this. Oh, they're not like this. You say? Oh. Yeah. All right, end the stream already. Yeah, what? I could be a weatherman. No, no. You don't think so? No. Oh. Well, not all your dreams are possible. Oh, I also can't be a pro football player. I realized that really early on when I was like the you've second to last kid everything. picked in football. You think you've seen everything now? All right. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching. Merry Christmas. Happy Hanukkah. Kwanzaa. I don't care what you celebrate as long as it celebrates narrative truth and freedom our core moral values here love. on this stream and alex throws love in at the end <laughs> team kanye team kanye was he talking about love always i'm team taylor swift i believe in her idea of complex love <laughs> thank you all for watching merry christmas everybody